to meet the growing needs of its students and the growing need of trade schools here in the Bay Area. So today, the district announced they'll create three new schools dedicated to workforce development. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell shares how students think this opportunity will help pave the way to a new career. Freshman Hunter Short discovered a love for welding from his dad. It's like a form of art, kind of, and uh, I just wanted that to be my career. Now an opportunity to keep building on his knowledge. Hillsborough County Public Schools will launch a new initiative focused on workforce development. Superintendent Addison Davis announced the district will create two new high schools and a technical college dedicated to a specific area of workforce development. The Hillsborough Building and Construction Academy at Bowers Whitley and Hillsborough Medical Academy at DW Waters will serve students 9th through 12th grade. Both will launch fall 2023. We will offer programs at industry certifications that allow our students to be actively engaged in building and design, building instruction, HVAC, refrigeration, heating technology. The Hillsborough Medical Academy is currently partnering with major hospitals and medical care centers to be able to identify equipment, resources, curriculum to be able to in jobs that they need in order to be successful. In addition, Hillsborough County School says by transitioning programs to other HCPS sites, Brewster Technical College can be transitioned into a medical technical college. There's money to be made in the workforce now. We see our community agencies, our organizations, our construction fields, our medical fields, they're screaming for employees. Students tell me they see the benefit too, creating opportunity and access, whether it's for college or straight into the workforce. It's teaching kids who don't really know where they're going to go in life to, you know, hopefully have a career for them set up in the future. In Hillsborough County, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.